Allie LaForce on the sidelines. So Phoenix will get the first possession. There's a screen by Nurkic. To the inside. And Nurkic throws it down. Yeah, when he sets the pick, Nurkic can do different things on the roll. <laughs> Makes him hard to track. Doris, in terms of assist to turnover ratio, Tyus Jones normally leads the league. B.A., this guy is such a steady hand at the lead guard position. Tyus always makes excellent decisions, plays within himself, and plays mistake-free basketball. Just such a terrific dunker. Yeah, born to fly, that's for sure. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Earlier, I spoke with Nick Nurse, and he let me in on their strategy for Devin Booker. He said no easy shots for Booker tonight. We only want him taking off-balance tough looks. At least, that's our hope. Sounds like they'll be throwing everything they can at Booker defensively, B.A. Great work, Allie. Thanks. And that's the hunger that Embiid plays with. He just gobbles up the miss and goes back up for the score. Shot by Nurkic, no good. To the paint. Here's George. And George with the jam. Oh, yes, sir. PJ making it look easy. Pass to Nurkic. Booker with it. Maxi covering. From deep. Out of bounds. It'll be Philadelphia's ball. Now the 76ers with it. First quarter, just about two minutes in. Maxi on the wing. Back to George. And George with the jam. You know, one thing about Maxi is that he always is looking for an outlet. All right, Doris, what's kind of an unsung stat you appreciate about the Suns lineup? Wow, they are so gifted offensively. So I'd have to say very good at getting to the free throw line. That's important. Very good at baiting defenders and putting your opponent into the bonus. That's big. Attacking into coverage. They get to spend plenty of time at the free throw line. It's, a, it's an underrated advantage, B.A. Here's George. Following the score by Phoenix. Five to shoot. Shoots over Booker. Here's Embiid. Lays it up and banks it in. Embiid's got six. I love the confidence Embiid plays with, especially this close to the rim. Durant on the attack. And it's slammed in by Durant. Oh my God, that was impressive. How many guys can flush it like this man? Not many, that's for sure. He can really fly. He's a force. I mean, it gets a lot easier when you face little to no resistance. The control and focus from Embiid, able to absorb hits from the defense and still finish. Here's Booker. The teardrop. And he lays it in. Well, the touch and the focus. What a pretty move in the lane. It's George on the drive. And George with the jam. Boy, you have got to love the energy Paul George is playing with. Throws the hammer down. Durant. Assisted by... That's in. Coming off an assist from Jones. I love this approach. Getting him involved early, and it's already paying off. They know that if this guy goes off, their chances of winning rise exponentially. Now here's George. Six points for him. And George with the jam. He's just too quick to the cup. No one near him to get posted. Durant for three. 
Rebound by Philadelphia. Tipped. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Durant. A great read to get a hand in there and disrupt the play. And offensively, a little bit of a careless toss. You could have used a better angle on that pass. George outside. Nifty move. Rebounded by Nurkic. Suns trail by six. Here's Booker. And he drives in. Yep, count it. Booker's got six. Such a multi-talented threat on the offensive end, and you love his confidence. The three, George. Three. Fires in the triple. And Mike Budenholzer decides to call a timeout. <laughs> and we might see some changes. Rhythm Coach looking to adjust. is the order of the day as the first quarter comes to a close. The Sixers on top, up by seven. And quarter number two will get underway just after this short break. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter of action so far. And a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the 76ers. The way they just continue to drive right at the defense, they've really been overwhelming them when they do this. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. Hey, Brian. Well, Kevin Durant steadily climbing up the top 10 of the all-time scoring list. He said, I've been in the league for half of my life now. It's a blessing to be playing on this platform and doing what I love to do. I just want to continue to keep putting in good work and keep adding to what I already did. One of the greats, Allie. Thank you. Pass to Maxi. Inside. Oh, look out! Joel Embiid with a power jam! Now, Embiid can throw it down from anywhere. So much power for the big fella. And Grant, I know you played a part in Embiid's decision to join Team USA. Yeah, B.A., I spent a lot of time talking to Joel Embiid and convincing him to play for us in the U.S. men's national team. To the middle. This is the baby hook. And so Durant will bring it up for the Suns. Trailing by 10. Here's Booker. Oh, Booker in close. Boy, you see how confident Devin Booker is down low. Doesn't even think twice about looking to score in there. Maxi attacking. Pass to Embiid. It's Embiid again missing. Suns trail by eight. Here's Booker. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Devin Booker is a two-guard doors. What's Book do that makes him special at that position? I mean, so many things in terms of his skill. He's an elite shooter. He has become an excellent decision maker. He can get to the mid-range. He's a three-level scorer. There's so many things. But my favorite thing is watching this guy in an NBA Finals play with a broken nose, be hit repeatedly, and never flinch. His toughness and competitive edge is always there nightly in the eye. Love that. Though Paul George won't be shy. You give him a driving lane, he will expose you defensively. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. Back to Booker. Shoots over Maxi. Booker can't get it to go. Boy, a miss like that will drive any score crazy, especially with the defender giving a cushion. Back to Martin. Three-pointer. Count it. One for one to start the game. Well, the defense deserves to get burned. Absolutely no excuse for leaving him open. O'Neal on the wing.
Parker with it. Nine points in the game. And it's slammed in by Durant. That KD is showing a little bit of elevation. George, right side. Martin, outside. Two minutes remaining. George, outside. Two minutes. Carries it down low. George has got five points in the quarter. You've allowed Paul George to lock in and get his rhythm. Now you better start to stop him. Despite Joel Embiid missing more than half of their games, Grant, the Sixers still won 47 games last season. Yeah, B.A., and lots of credit goes to Tyrese Maxey, averaging over 26 points a game. Philadelphia also had some good depth, and that really helped. Martin outside. Pass to Drummond. It's deflected. Here's Durant. And Durant slams it home. How about the quick jump from Kevin Durant? He was impressive on that one. And timeout is called by Nick Nurse. Coach wants to speak to his guys, maybe alter some of the game plan. Phoenix making a switch here. Here's Lowry. And 101 left to the second period. And then B throws it down. The reverse slam. That was sweet. Ah, the finesse on full display. Beal's got room. And it's Phoenix with another. Terrific footwork. Beal pulling up in rhythm. It's beautiful. Up top, Embiid. There's 37 seconds left to the second. Four on the clock. All alone. And it's Phoenix with a rebound. All alone from mid-range. They know he won't miss many of those. Durant. And one of the best things about Kevin Durant is he simply locks in on exactly what's in front of him at the moment. If that means working at practice, that's what he does. If that's competing at a high level in the game, that's what he does. An efficient night from the line. This is a guy who puts in the work and it pays dividends. And here's Embiid. 12 points for him. Shot is good by Gordon. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Three-pointer Beal. And we're through the first half. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, a good one. Yo. Philadelphia on <laughs> good job, good job. They're up by two, four. Two. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on 2K Sports. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been a fairly even one. Philadelphia leading by four. Outside Maxi. Gordon on the wing. Looking at lineups around the league, Grant. It seems like they're becoming more positionless than ever before. Yeah, you're spot on, B.A. To the point where some people feel all-star voting shouldn't be by position anymore. It should be by merit. O'Neal on the wing. Beal outside. Five on the clock. Puts the move on. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it. It's good. Beal's got seven points in the game. Well, this is what you want, right? Bradley Beal coming off the screen with purpose. Maxi on the wing. No points yet. And Tyrese Maxi gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul of the game. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. Down low. And Durant with the big finish. 
Kevin Durant. And Kevin Durant just lighting up the stat sheet right now. He's in a rhythm, and that's trouble. To the middle. Here's Embiid. And Embiid throws it down. Well, deliver the pass where your teammate can do something with it. Nice. Time now to hear from our reporter, Ali LaForce. Well, guys, the Suns are going for it. All-star guard Devin Booker said, everybody here is on the same page. We're in win-now mode. We want excellence. We know it's not going to be easy, but when you give up that much, we're trying to win this year and years to come. Ryan, this front office has been aggressive. They are all in, Allie. Thank you. Talking about Tyrese Maxey Grant, here's a guy who's improved every year. Yeah, B.A., I mean, from averaging eight as a rookie to 26 points during his breakout fourth year, Maxey has added to his game every offseason and turned himself into an elite scorer. Spins. Durant. Durant. Oh, Durant playing big in the paint. Well, Kevin Durant has an ability to put the ball on the deck and finish off the drive. Prime example there. It's Martin on the wing. And a strong finish with two hands. <laughs> and plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. Well, credit him for going for it, not settling, saying, I'm going to attack. Pass to Durant. The Suns need to get off a shot. Here's Beal. That went a little long. The Sixers leading. George feels it out a bit. And there's the call on Yusuf Nurkic. That's his first foul of the game. The Suns making a switch here. And Mike Budenholzer decides to call a timeout. He wants to review the game plan. Second half of play, and we're three minutes into the third here. Martin outside. The three-pointer off the mark. And Booker's got the ball here for the Phoenix Suns. Their defense has only allowed six points in the second half. Transition basketball, the most reliable way to generate easy looks. The very definition of quality transition offense. If it can end at the cup, it's exactly where you want it. Philadelphia shooting their second free throw attempt on the night. You really can't understate the energy Maxi brings to his game. Not just effort level, but his attitude and how that spreads to his guys out there. Gordon with a steal. Left side Maxi. Puts up a three. Sinks it from distance. Maxi's got six points in the quarter. Not everyone has the green light to take that free in transition, but he does, especially with the defense already set up protecting the paint. Let's it fly. Again, the sun's good for two. Lightning quick release on that jumper. No one could get to Booker in time. Right side, Maxi. Two points. That one goes. Maxi's got eight. Assertive move. You can tell the game's heating up a bit. Pass to Nurkic. Back to Beal. To the paint. Outside for Booker. Just three to shoot. Drummond grabs the miss. The Sixers lead by six. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's Maxi. And he converts the layup. Maxi's got 10 points here in the second half. Oh, a high motor in close to the rim. Maxi finding a window and converting. Inside. Outside O'Neal. Pass to Bowl. For three, Booker. 
And so it's the Philadelphia 76ers. Hey, you saw the message, huh? He said the end of the period. I see the one can't take over. I saw it. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. Suns trail by eight. Pass to Plumlee. Beal outside. There's a screen by Bull. And here's Booker. Maxi covering. Just five to shoot. Here's Plumlee. He drains it as the shot clock ticks down. With a tough road ahead, they worked hard to get a good shot. Embiid with it. Here's Embiid. Ooh, good D by Plumlee. Back to Beal. To the inside. Here's Booker. That one's in there on the nice assist from Beal. You can see the level of attention Bradley Beal draws. This guy is so heady finding the open teammate. Here's George. He takes it in. Misfire there. Now seven for 11. Pass to Beal. Jacks up a three. It's hauled in by the Sixers. George outside. And here's Martin. Three-pointer. And it's Paul George with the three. George has got 19 points. It can't leave any room for Paul George outside. He will deliver from deep. Pass to Bowl. Down low. Here's Booker. Sinks it again. No, it's his seventh made field goal in 11 tries. Yeah, the thing about Booker, not necessarily the quickest twitch athlete. He uses that smooth handle to gain separation. Here's George. Here's Embiid. And Embiid throws it down. And it's so hard to stop the putback. And he live at the rim like that. Boy, once he gets his hands on it around the rim, it's too late. How about the activity level, the effort level? This team right now feeding off his energy. And Mike Budenholzer decides to call a timeout. He's decided it's time to clarify the situation, leaving little room for error. And the Suns making a change here. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Over that last break, guys, I got a chance to hear what Mike Budenholzer said to the team. He told the guys to stay after it inside. He said our play inside is terrific right now. He said don't lose any of that intensity. Stay strong down there. It's always nice to hear a coach enjoying his team's play. Back to you. Appreciate the report, Ali. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for Philadelphia. Well, not content to take what the defense gives them. I mean, they're attacking the gaps and getting the ball inside. George outside. Uneasy, too, on the layup. George has got five points in the quarter. Yeah, very efficient, Paul George. is a finisher in the painted area. Pass to O'Neal. Let's the three fly. Philadelphia grabs the miss. If you want to cut into a lead, you have got to trust your teammates and move the ball. Well, known for being a terrific passer, he shows you right there. Case in point. Screen by Duran. Hooker surveying the floor. Outside Duran. Yep, that one's good. Durant's got 22 points. See how quick Kevin Durant is off the floor near the rim. That's tough to stop. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It goes on Mason Plumley. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. Second one is good, getting both at the line. And it's an eight-point ball game. 
Booker has got the ball here for the Suns. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Yeah, just an offensive machine. Booker generates points consistently night in and night out. Philadelphia leading by five. Now George. And the jam by George. You can see why they go to this guy so often. More often than not, he's going to be very efficient like he is right here. Pass to Plumley. Beal outside. Now here's Durant. Defended by Gordon. Just five on the clock. Durant draws the double. Yes! <laughs> oh, and that cuts the lead to just five. Yo, that's so. Wow, got it. Oh, Embiid is that food high. Wow. Yo, okay. good as it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. And the 76ers lead by seven. Pass to Durant. Beyond the arc. The rebound by Maxi. Here's Philadelphia. Go, go, go. Wow. Yo, 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 yo. Wow. So it's Philadelphia picking up the wow. win. But a win's a win. And so true, but you have to credit the crowd for giving them such a big boost towards the team. And be paid to you. Four alley LaForce. Durant 